Oh, hello there. Allow me a moment to put my remote down, my walking stick, and my back. My name is John Muir. I helped shape America's National Park Service. I pushed really hard to preserve wildlife and teach people about nature. I was born on April 21st, 1838, and I died December 24th, 1914. I was born in Scotland, actually, but I moved to America when I was 11 years old. During my time in Scotland, we played in the famous Dunbar Castle, and we ran around in nature with my friends, and we ran around in nature, racing each other through the wildlife. Boy, that was a glorious time. In 1867, or 29 years old, I was working at a factory. When I was adjusting a loose file, it sprung up and hit me in the eye, blinding me. I had to sit in a black room for four weeks, and during those four weeks, I thought about nature and all the beautiful places of the world, like the Yosemite Valley, which I might never get to see. But after the four weeks were over, I could see perfectly well again. I found myself only to work with God's creations now. When I was 54 years old, in the year 1892, I found the Sierra Club, which has become now one of the greatest clubs that preserves nature, but when I was created it, I was immediately elected president of it. In 1903, when I was 65 years old, I guided the president, President Roosevelt, through Yosemite Valley. Here, I have a picture of him in just in my backpack. A glorious time. We, for four days, me and Teddy went around the Yosemite Valley exploring nature together. Boy, it was a glorious day. <sighs> the most important and meaningful event was when I first went to Yosemite. And I stated, nature has gathered her most choicest treasure this year. The height of the, f but when I first saw all the falls, the height of them had filled me. I, from over there, I worked my companion. You see those falls, they look to be 15 or 20 feet tall from over here. But they're probably like 60 or 70 feet. Boy, was I fooled. They were 620 feet tall. If I could live my life over again, I'd persevere harder to make the hetch hetchy would not have been down. Both my heart and I lost all means of life when I was down. This is what Hetch Hetchy used to look like. Beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful, isn't it? But when they dammed it, it all got flooded and went away. Half of the valley was flooded. Boy, I broke, broke my heart in two. The way I changed the world was by founding the Sierra Club 
and for my fierce protection of nature. But they think that I be changed the world most for it's showing that one man's voice can make a difference.